Now, on Tuesday night, we have the W Awards and the NAB AFLW Rising Star for 2021 will be crowned. Now, I'm giving you another go at this because last time we, we discussed this, you had to issue an apology and you were, you know, Mr. <laughs> teammate of yours. So who is going to take out this award? Oh, there's some sensational names on there. And you're only, if you want to get excited about the future of AFLW, just look at this list for a bit longer. But, yeah, I mean, there's been a whole half of a season since I made that mistake, Nat. <laughs> so <laughs> she, they've all had a, an opportunity to put in more of a body of work. But... I'm going to have to go with my teammate, Tyler Hanks, just for the, the roles and responsibilities she's had in there. I mean, all the talk around our side in the off-season was the loss of Elise O'Day amongst other players and how we were going to fill the void in the midfield. And someone like Tyler's just stepped up and really taken that opportunity with two hands. She's had big jobs each week. We send her to Bowers, we send her to Marinoff. Um, and just her body of work across the whole season, her consistent impact that she has, I think she has to win it. But in saying that, Mackenzie and Jess Fitzgerald, worthy nominees and um, have had some outstanding games at times as well. Yeah, Fitzgerald started strongly and then Ellie McKenzie came home like a freight train, mm. but I think Tyler's the one that's been really consistent across the whole season, as you say.